Up, lifetime successes LTS is coming from the Asana. Woo, it's hot in here. It's hot in here. Let's get hot today. You know, today we about to sweat out that scared, that wondering, that guessing. We're about to get that out. So sit in here with me for a little bit. You know, I already been in here for about it was 20 minutes, doing 20 minutes. I uh, I'm doing 20 minutes a day, uh, so I think I did 10 already. So, you know, I, I won't keep you guys long. See, let me get these headphones. These headphones literally are are um are are burning the back of my neck. Sorry about that. I had the text message come up. Let's get to it, guys. Um, you gotta realize, guys, the people that win, you can't think that the people that win don't fail. The people that win is the people that don't give up, that don't quit, you know, don't throw fits, don't, don't throw tension tantrums, don't sit there and expect everybody to say, hey, poor me, you know, you got to stop being afraid of failing, guys, you got to stop being afraid of failure, only thing I ask you guys is not to quit. If your dreams don't give you goosebumps when you think about it, if your super, super, super goals don't get you hyped anytime you're talking about them, I'm telling you guys, you need to start being honest with yourself because it's not that. It's okay. Sometimes we think we know stuff, but then we don't. So sometimes we got to figure it out. So I got to get it warmed up in here right now for you guys because I think you guys, a lot of people is just afraid of what are they going to think of me? What if they don't like it? What if they what if people what if people say my stuff is not good? Man, believe in yourself. Believe in yourself. You came in this world by yourself. You leaving by yourself. Let's talk about relationships. It's cool to have a significant other that can push you. But why the that's the, if anything. I need to tell you it's okay when the lineman, the lineman is pushing the quarterback in. But 9 out of 10, it's not always going to happen. You got to get in there. You got a Superman, woo, like Cam. You got to go head first, dive over. You guys got to go dive into these things. Be honest with yourself. Research things that you need to do better. Honestly, guys, stop being scared little pussies, man. Scar, sorry for the language. I just I get real passionate about this, and I try my best to to calm it down and PG it up. But you know, it's not gonna be like that all the time. You know why? Cause this is me. I'm not trying to act for nobody. All I'm saying, going over here, you know, mother, that, nut, nut, nut. But if I gotta say something, I'ma say it. So moving on, guys. This is from the heart, man. Y'all gotta stop being scared. Get your ass up the off the couch and, and go and find some failure. If you're afraid and you want that girl, stop being scared. She say no, so what? I said this today, guys, and I want you guys to take this. This came out of my mouth and somebody said before, I don't know, I don't really care. But I said the people that are sleeping on me, stay with me. The people that are sleeping with me, uh, sleeping with me, my bad, sleeping on me. Let's get back to it. You can sleep on me all you want, but know you're going to wake up and see me because I'm going to be your worst nightmare. You understand that quote that I just told you? Let them sleep on you. And just when they say, oh, 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 <laughs> they ain't going to do it. They ain't got, the, they, they don't got the pop. They, they, they don't got the stamina. Let me, 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 before I finish that quote, because it's a little bit to go with it. I remember my um, senior year, I used to always, my coach used to tell me, this is wrestling. I used to always be worried about the rankings and all that stuff. Going all the way, I, I when I got, I ended up getting. I remember when I first got my, uh, was ranked second in the state, and I was thinking, oh man, why, why can't, why am I not first? I'm thinking about I'm reading the, the uh, I'm reading the, uh, the boards and and uh, this is you know technology doesn't advance so much. But back in the day, we had the little, uh, uh, cause I, I wrestled in India and obviously, um, and uh, we had uh, I can't even remember what that, that it's been so long, man. But I used to be on there. I used to, my coach, like, I do not want you on there. I comment on it. But you know, I was already, I was already defeated before I even got to stay. You know why? 
Because I was worried about what they going to do. Should I be here? Everything but what I want to do. And that, and that hit me hard. It took me a while to get over that. Don't live with regrets. You know what I, You know what mostly an old folks home is? A lot of regret. Full of regret. Full of regret. Don't be that. So let me get back and go back into the quote. Like I said. So my Samsung done pooped out on me, man. And then pussy out on me. But it's all good because, you know, this. I had planned on doing a different video today. Uh, but, you know, I got it here and, um, you know, having passion for doing this is all real. You know, even when I write stuff down, it's real. It's just I like to have a direction. But sometimes when you don't got no map, you just go straight. You'll find your way back to what I was saying, guys. Stop listening to people. Stop being scared of failure. Stop being scared of failure. Failure is not always bad. Hell in the way. It's, if you can you can always change failure until you die. Then we could talk about how it'd be bad. And like I just told you about the old folks having regret and the old folks home. You know, you want to die saying I did everything I could. You know, saying I tried everything I could. 50 Cent is, that's the best why that CD hit, I think, for most people. Get rich or die trying. Basically saying, I'm going to do everything I got to do. I'm going to sweat. I'm going to crawl. I'm going to run. I'm going to scream. I'm going to roar. I'm going to do it all until I do get through it all. And if I don't get it, cross my arms and close that casket. Survive with me a little bit more, like I was telling you guys. Stop thinking what people think. If somebody came here right now, you know what they're going to do? They're going to sit right next to me and I'm going to finish this video. Because I'm not going to be like, hey, uh, you don't mind if I do? Look, I don't care. Now, if you don't want to be on the camera, that's fine. But I got business to handle. You feel me? So, that's because you can't let nobody get into your dreams. My little baby brother, I'm so proud of him right now. And if he sees this video, he know I am because he's starting a business. And I didn't care if he said he was going to start a business collecting toothpicks. I'm going to be proud of him. And I'm proud of you, too, if you start something. It ain't always got to be a business. Start something. Live for something. As a man, you better have purpose. That's number one. You know, you better have purpose. I'm, I'm talking to you men so y'all can teach these young men. You know? A lot of times when I was young, man, my grandma was a lot of times when my grandpa was working. But I learned through my grandpa's actions. He didn't have to talk. I knew when he was mad. I knew what he meant. I knew when he was about that action. I knew when you better not mess up. I'm telling you, but the failure is what I learned from. And you know, when I left my grandpa's house in 19, the only thing I want to do is give him a hug. I don't care how long we don't talk from a man's perspective. It's always A1. We connect with each other no matter what from where we started. It's all love. And I love that man for that. But a lot of stuff is through failure. He let me figure it out for myself. He gave me guidelines, but he wasn't going to be there all the time. So he made it a little balance. You know how I love that balance. So, guys... Stop sitting here and being afraid to jump in without your life jacket. With this thing, if you drown, you drown. But if you die going doing what you wanted to do, so be it. But figuratively speaking, guys, we know we know with life we ain't swimming right now. We just we, we right now we just talking about hypothetical. Put yourself in the best predicament you can be. Put yourself in the best predicament you can be. Right now, I, I you know I've been feeling a little under the weather, so you know what I'm doing. I, I'm trying to. I'm getting toxins out of my body. Actually, guys, to be honest, I ain't going. I ain't going no jerk program stuff. But you know, I stopped drinking. I, ne don't, I don't get me. I never had no problem. I just want to see what my body's like drinking, and I want to. And I'm and I'm doing it for studies as far as like, do people need to really drink? A lot of people drink for social social boundary social social uh, gatherings and all that. And I want to see how do I how did I used to interact? It's not like I always been a huge drinker. Sometimes I have started drinking, but I didn't really take it into account. This 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 lifetime success. Let me give you a little background and not getting off of the video too much. This is all for human research. I want to be a life coach. I want to be an inspiration to people, whether it's a trainer, a father, a brother you never had. Uh, 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 I, I don't care what it is. A coach, it don't matter. I want to be able to touch people in the best way I can. And there's so many ways you can do this. It's, all, it's huge. There's so many ways. 
I just get geeked sometimes and I, that's why I have to write stuff down. Because I get geeked and I be like uh, over here like Dory. What, what, what was I going to say? Because I, I really, really feel like there's such a big space for this. It's just about getting over your fears. I'm not really worried about who don't accept me. This may be me and this guy in this room. Me right here because nobody's in here. And then we just talking to each other. That's fine. Because we got each other. I got your back, bro. I got your back. Have, your, have yourself back. And then, you know, I rambled on a little bit more. This is why I always make sure I have my uh, diagram. But the guys, basically, you know what I said. You know what I meant, guys. We don't need to, we don't need to keep talking. We don't need to beat, beat it over. Just keep beating it and beating it and beating it. Y'all got what I said. Get out there and get messy a little bit. Get out there and like I told you the other day, give it your all. You know? And I'm about to get out of this thing because I got to go get ready to eat and all that stuff. But I'm going to check back in with y'all, man. We gonna, I'm, gonna I'm, I'm counting on y'all. Get it done. Country, get her done. Get, get it done. Get it done. Get it done. So don't forget to live. Don't forget to learn. Woo. And don't forget to grow. Boom, watch that bad y'all. Go.